every day, better every day. Okay, guys. This vid is going to be a little bit different. My fandom. This is going to show my fandom. This is why I'm a fan here. I'm going to rank all of the positions. And I'm going to do my favorite Browns players. Not necessarily the best, but my favorite Browns players. And we're going to go in order. So, let's get to it. First one, quarterback. Aye, 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 quarterback. Qualifications of this list is that they had to play for the Browns at least one year. Quarterback number one was Derek Anderson. He was by far my favorite quarterback, mainly because of that 2007 year. And you're gonna hear some people again from this 2007 year, because I love this year in general. The numbers that he put up that year, minus the interceptions were amazing in that time period. The amount of touchdowns and that offense was rolling. That offense was cooking. First winning season in a while. Afterwards, we didn't have another winning season, guys, until the 2020 season. So 13 years later is when the Browns had another winning season, but I will always remember Derrick Anderson. Favorite halfback, 100% Nick Chubb. I love Nick Chubb. I'm worried every time he runs the ball. We have right now a top three running back in the league, and I dare to say that he would be challenging Henry if he was not sharing carries with one of the best other running backs in the league. They have top 15 running backs in the league. The first string running back and the second string running back. And the reason why Kareem Hunt works is because he's a Cleveland guy. Like, he, he was born in Ohio. Browns is one of his teams. So he loved to play for the Browns. So Nick Chubb, without a shadow of a doubt. So wide receiver, it's literally like a choice between three guys. Three or four guys itself. And my choice is the obvious choice, man. Josh Gordon. 100% Josh Gordon. That year that he put up with 1,300 yards, nine tutties, with two 200 back-to-back -back yard receiving games. Not to mention he led the league in receiving yards. Not to mention that he was suspended the first game or the first second with first two games for substance abuse. That was a magical wide receiver season and too bad it was just wasted on bad front office at the time and horrible quarterback play. He did that with three different quarterbacks. The man was just freaky talented at the point and it was unreal. Tight end. It's a lot of good tight ends that I've liked over the years. One of my favorite guy from USC, Jordan Cameron. I love Jordan Cameron's game. I thought he was so athletic when he first came out, former basketball player. I thought we had our Antonio Gates, man. He never really lived up to the building, and if we can really think about it, he had one Pro Bowl year. Tackles, no question, man. First ballot Hall of Famer, Joey Thomas. It's not even close with that. Guard. See, here's the thing. It's recency bias because, like, I love how Wyatt Teller has came on. But if you look at the guards over the years, we've had so many great guards. My favorite guard has to be Wyatt Teller. I'm using recency bias. Center, I would say LaCharles Bentley. But due to the fact that we can't, he did not step foot on the field. So I can't say him. So I'm going to give this to Alex Mack. I remember the year, that was the year Eric Mangini traded so many picks and it was just ridiculous. Um, Alex Mack, defensive end, Miles Garrett, no said, no questions. Defensive tackle, Big Ted Washington. All right, linebacker, I would say Dequel Jackson, but I'm going to go with a player that barely got playing time, but I always saw potential in him. And this is showing my age, but Sean Thompson, I absolutely loved Sean Thompson, a linebacker. He was fast, he could cover. Just injuries and the constant changing of coaching. He was never able to really like get into a system where they can properly use his strengths because this is around the time where coaching, we were recycling coaching every year, every two years. Cornerback is Joe Hayden, man. 100% Joe Hayden. And I hate the fact that we had to let him go to the Steelers, but Joe Hayden is my favorite cornerback. Um, he was a top five corner in his prime. Teams did not throw to that side in this prime. Safety, TJ Ward. TJ Ward was one of my sa favorite safeties growing up. Him and Sean Jones and then kicker, Bill Dawson, man. Punter would be Dave Zasterdale. Josh Cribs, kick returner. Nothing else needs to be said about that. I would like to start a conversation below in the comments. 
if you want to list and rank off your favorite players, you know, we can keep the discussion going. And remember, guys, it's always next year. But this year, 